Good morning, everybody. This is Kathy, and I am here for Mixed Media Frenzy. Now, I have already um, gessoed the back of my paper, and don't forget, while I am preparing the background, go check out Krista, Ronnie, Kathy, Dolly, and the Scrappy Sisters. Go check out their channels and see how they are doing this scrap lift of a layout. I have it up in the top left hand corner. Now I am using Cotton Candy Pink from Lindy's and an older shim. It's a Recollections Gray and it has shimmer in it and it it dries like a brownish gray, but I wipe some of it up because I didn't want it real dark, but it's like a real light color. I squirt some water on there, try to get it to move a little bit. I'm not the best at mixed media. I do this mixed media frenzy just to get me going on mixed media. I buy the stuff. I love it when everybody else uses it, but I'm with you. I, it is so hard for me to do. So I do the simplest thing I can <laughs> with the mixed media. So I use the packaging technique on the background and then just let it flow the way it wanted to. Now I did pull out some vellum and I think it's wedding vellum because it has hearts all over it, but it's gray. So I love that look behind the photo. Now I did choose a couple papers from Vicki Booten and I think it's Feel notes. I'm not for sure what collection it's from. I had scraps in my drawer. Alright, so I'm going to put, I'm using a larger photo. And I want to make sure it sticks to the mixed media. So I put it right about there. Then I found some journaling card and some... See, now I thought that matched, like, her photo, and, and then I cut these out, and I'm going to title it. The layout that I have up in the corner has, has the numbers over to the left, and her title is something like, So Many Reasons, so I am putting 10 Reasons Why. Now, the photo, this is Lily. Lily loves stuffed animals, and she loves to name them. This stuffed animal, you can give it a bath with you. So that's kind of why it's kind of scruffy. But she loves her. She named her Chloe after my little Shih Tzu that I had. And she loved the name Chloe, and she misses Chloe, so she named her Chloe. Now, I went ahead and numbered. I'm just going to number, like, um, all the reasons why she loves Chloe. So that's what I'm going to put on there. I glue all the numbers on there, just kind of scatter them around, kind of like they do in the sketch. And then I make just a little embellishment up top. I put, hello, friend. And I thought that went really well with my layout. I do pull some thread in because um, Missy Witten, she uses thread a lot. So I wanted to pull that in. All right, so next thing, I'm just going to add some little bits and bobs. I tried to put the banners in, but I just didn't like it with my layout. I do, however, use this 
um, silver and black arrow. It kind of goes with the butterfly and the hello, just to bring the black around. And I think that is it. My layout's pretty simple, which is my style. I love how it turned out, and I hope you enjoyed it. And don't forget to go check out the other girls and leave them a nice comment. And my finishing touches, I'm adding some silver stars. And thank you so much for coming. Bye-bye.